when to remove concrete forms? If you're working on a concrete project and wondering when it's the right time to remove the forms, you're in the right place. Let's break down the details to ensure your project turns out strong and stable. First, it's crucial to understand that concrete forms are like molds that hold the concrete in place until it sets. Removing these forms too early or too late can have significant consequences. The key is to wait until the concrete has gained enough strength to hold its shape without the forms. Generally, you can remove the formwork 24 to 48 hours after pouring and finishing the concrete. However, this time frame can vary depending on several factors. For instance, the weather plays a big role. In warm weather, concrete sets faster, while in cold weather, below 50 degrees Fahrenheit, it sets much slower. This means in colder conditions, you might need to wait longer before removing the forms. The type of concrete mix also affects the timing. If you're using a fast-setting cement, the concrete will gain strength quicker than if you're using ordinary Portland cement. Additionally, the water-cement ratio and any admixtures in the mix can influence how quickly the concrete cures. To determine if the concrete is ready for form removal, you can do a visual inspection. If the concrete has hardened and pulled away from the sides of the form slightly, it's usually a good sign that it has set sufficiently. However, a more reliable method is to conduct non-destructive tests to ensure the concrete has achieved the required strength. Removing the forms too soon can lead to serious issues like structural instability, cracking, and even concrete failure. On the other hand, leaving the forms on for too long isn't typically a problem, but it does delay the project. The general rule is to ensure the concrete can support its own weight and any loads it will bear before removing the forms. In some cases, especially for commercial projects, the required interval for form removal might be specified by job requirements. It's always a good idea to consult a structural engineer if you're unsure about the timing, especially when dealing with load-bearing structures. Proper curing of the concrete is also essential. This involves keeping the right moisture levels inside the concrete to ensure it becomes strong and durable. Methods like water curing, using moisture retaining covers, or applying membrane curing compounds can help maintain the necessary conditions. In summary, the timing for removing concrete forms is critical and depends on factors like weather, concrete mix, and curing conditions. By waiting the right amount of time and ensuring the concrete has sufficient strength, you can avoid common pitfalls and achieve a strong, stable final product.